how to connect a USB mouse to your iPad Pro. Well, first of all, if your iPad Pro has a lightning connector, then you need a USB-A to lightning adapter. If you have a newer iPad Pro, which uses the USB-C plug here, then what you would need is a USB-C to USB-A adapter, just like this one here. Or in that case, you could also use something like a USB hub, like this one here, which on one end here has a USB-C plug, and then here on the other hand has several USB-A ports. So the first thing you would do is you actually connect your adapter to your iPad Pro, just like that. Then we plug our mouse in. And on my iPad here now, you can see that the mouse is already working. However, that is because I already adjusted some settings on the iPad beforehand. So if you connect it for the first time, that will not be the case for you. So here's what you need to do. First of all, you will have to go into the settings app. Then here on the left side, go to accessibility. Then tap on touch. And then here on top, make sure that assistive touch is turned on. You should already see your USB mouse now on your iPad device. Here in this menu, when you actually tap on devices, on the connected devices, you should then also see your USB mouse. Also, if you go back here, and then again here, go back, and once more, you can also change the appearance of your mouse a bit. And for that, go to pointer control here. And here you can then choose the color for your pointer. So in my case, it is set to red. And then here, using the slider, you can also make the pointer size a little bit bigger. So let us try that. And now, as you can see, we have a huge mouse pointer on the screen. Last but not least, here below, you can also adjust the scrolling speed. So if you feel that you can't control your mouse because everything moves too fast, you can reduce the speed here. Or if your mouse moves too slow, you can go here and increase the speed. And this is basically all you need to know to connect your USB mouse to an iPad Pro. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more iPad tutorials.